Right, well, the team had a busy doubleheader weekend last weekend. How do you feel the results went? Um, well, we went one and one, so we picked up one win at home against Cardiff, and then unfortunately we uh, took a loss against Solent. Overall, very happy. Um, the Cardiff game, we, we did the job. We cut out their main threat, and the girls got us over the line. Uh, the Solent game, a little bit of an experience showed, but um, there's no excuses with that one. Um, we took a tough loss to a good team. Um, we now have Christmas break, so we're looking to reassess, regroup, and sort of go again in, in 2021. How do you feel the first half of the season went? Fantastically, all things yeah. considered. Um, we're playing in a global pandemic. It's absolutely crazy times, and the girls have been fantastic. They've been professional. They've been everything that a Worcester Wars player should be. So I'm immensely proud of the, every single one of them and their commitment and dedication to the team. Um, and we're five and two, so you know what? We're in a really good spot. Um, but there is work to be done and improvements to be made going into the second half of the season. It's been great to see so many of the players featuring in the NBL Team of the Week and also getting Player of the Week. How proud are you of the team this year? Super proud. Couldn't be prouder of the girls. Um, they are a team. They give up good for great. They, they uh, make the extra pass. They do some really, really good stuff on the court. And... Whenever a player is highlighted, the team know that that player couldn't have done it without them. Um, but when we, especially when we had both Carolina and Grace Brownell in the team, uh, in the team of the week, that was fantastic. And it shows how hard the girls are working um, and it shows the, the, their commitment and dedication to their craft. And it's just a joy to be around. And um, again, we're looking forward to going again in 2021 and, and pushing on to continue that, those trends and highlight how good our players are. As you mentioned, Solent was the last game for the Christmas break. Um, start again in 2021, as you say, in January. Uh, what are your aspirations for the rest of the season? Uh, well, we've got a Christmas training camp from the 4th um, of January, which I'm sure the girls are incredibly looking <laughs> forward to. Um, two sessions a day is it, going to be intense, but it's what we need. Um, the girls are enjoying a nice break now that they've earned, so it'll be good to get them back in. And it is to take each game as it comes. So we want to continue to get better, both individually and as a team. We want to continue to push um, to, to be better. And the only way we're going to do that is to be together as, as a group and sort of work through any, any sort of negative stuff that happens as a group, because it isn't always going to be rosy. There are going to be times where things are going to go bad and it's how you then react to those which I think we've done really well. And like I say, we've got two thirds of our season left to play. It's fantastic to have a season right now. And I must applaud Basketball England for that. But we're really looking to take full advantage of the opportunity that's been given to us. You say you want to take every game at a time, put it on the spot now. Where would you like to finish this season? Um, realistically? Realistically, this, this league is talented. Yeah. Um, anyone through one to uh, anyone from one to seven teams could beat each other on any, any day. We saw that with Loughborough beating Ipswich, we beat we beat Loughborough, Reading beat Solent, Solent yeah. beat us. So you're like, what's going to happen? Yeah. Which makes the league fantastic Very to watch. Very exciting. Very exciting league and the standard of player across the league is fantastic. So I have no idea what's going to happen. <laughs> uh, I'm enjoying coaching my team. That's my focus. And as long as these girls improve and continue to work while they're doing their studies, you know what? We're just going to be having a blast. It's great. Thank you, Ryan. Thank you.